What's up YouTube, it's Vapor Monkey, and I'm back to bring you my final impressions on the tugboat. Uh, I've been vaping this for a little over a month now. If you watched my original unboxing, I'll leave a link down below. It was of this when I had just received it. Around that time, shortly after, there was basically no shops with it in stock. But since then, I've noticed, I went and looked at a couple of uh, popular vape sites and seen that they're selling them and they're in stock. So if you're still interested in getting this RDA, um, or if you want to know more about it, check out my unboxing video down in the uh, description. I'll leave a link. And uh, if you're interested, I'll leave some links to where it's in stock. And don't hold me accountable to them being in stock because I don't know what they've got at each of these links. But that's that. Anyway, let's get down to this uh, final impression of the tugboat. Drop it. So first I want to start by saying I haven't had any issues like I expected with any of the construction. No issues with the washers holding under normal wear and tear with regular e-juice dripping through the drip tip, popping the top cap off and dripping directly to the coils. Um, I've put several different builds through this. If you follow me on Instagram or if you follow me on Twitter or anything like that, you'd seen I put a quad on this. I put a, a single between the two posts, uh, ran a single coil that way. <clears throat> I've done anarchist builds, 22 gauge builds. I ran numerous different types of builds and uh, the grub nuts are holding up very well. There's no signs of wear on the Allen wrench that came with it into the grub nuts, which has been an issue with me on uh, older RDAs and um, basically no complaints whatsoever. Everything is holding up on this RDA. The uh, one side of the logo that's engraved into the side of it has like wore a little bit, but I mean, it's still there and that's just nitpicking a bit, but I mean, all in all, it's a great RDA. Um, the only qualm I had with the RDA, the only con per se, is uh, the top cap, the uh, new airflow system they have on this RDA. It has a tendency when it's in your pocket and if you drop it in your pocket like this, when you're out and about at work or wherever and it's in your pocket, I reach in to grab it out of my pocket and when I grow to grab it out of my pocket, I end up pulling the top cap off. Or even when I'm wearing jeans and I put it back in my pocket, my uh, pocket liner will catch the top cap and pop it off in my pocket. Then I'll pull my, uh, my Mac out to take a vape and I'll realize the top is missing and I panic like, oh, where's my top cap? And it's in my pocket, thank God. I've had it fall off on the floor of my job too I mean but I mean all right all in all that's that's about it the uh, friction fit drip tip is really cool and uh, like version 2 I like the drip tip so much I do use it on other RDAs but then I try not to get into a habit of doing that because I like to keep my RDAs as well as like my mods all their accessories together with each other so that they don't get mixed up or lost or damaged and so I don't damage this drip tip, I keep it married with the tugboat as much as I'd like to use it on my other RDAs all the time. I just find myself surfing around shops in the web looking for drip tips similar to this one that I could use. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. It is about this tugboat and I have to say it's definitely worth the money if you have it to invest in it and you're in that um, category of vaping where you are willing to spend upwards of eighty to a hundred dollars and you're gonna really want something that you can appreciate and it'll give and give and give everything you throw at it I would totally recommend this RDA the post holes aren't gigantic uh, they aren't comparable to some of the other RDAs out there that have these gargantuan you know post holes and given that the positive and negative post holes are shared for dual coils you know you don't have any extra available room you just have the two individual post holes to do all your work with so uh, if you just like throwing fat gauge dual coils in there and stuff you're good to go as far as like stable and zippers and 
all those other wild coil builds out there. I mean, unless you're going to modify this, which I wouldn't because of the price of it, but unless you're going to do something like that, wouldn't even bother, you know, looking this way. But if you're into like flavor chasing and some cloud chasing, whatever flavor chasing is, uh, any of that, I would say go with this. Um, it's definitely going to become a collector's piece because they hold up. I mean, every tugboat I've ever had is holding up for me. So I definitely look forward to having this for a long time to come and uh, brings me nothing but joy. Anyway, um, this was my final impression. I don't know really what else to tell you about this other than that I'm glad of every penny I spent on it. Um, I have no cons to it other than the airflow ring popping off. As far as the top airflow control goes, I don't really mess with it too much. Sometimes I'll move it over a little bit and open it just to have that little extra airflow. But <clears throat> Really, I just, I don't use it, and uh, other than it popping off, I have no other problems with it. And uh, I guess that about covers my final impression of this RDA. Would I buy it again if I lost it? Of course. Um, would I recommend it to you if you're looking at buying it? Definitely. It's an awesome RDA. But I'm not here to sell this thing to you, I'm just telling you what I think about it. Anyway, this was my final impression of the Tugboat version 3. If you're uh, looking to get one, I'll leave some links where they were in stock when I put the links up. Hopefully you'll be able to find one. Maybe you shop around and get one on sale. Anyway, this is Vapin' Monkey. For those of you that watch and subscribe, thank you. Give this video a like and uh, give me a subscribe. Support the cause. And uh, until the next video, I'll see you later. Keep your cotton wet. Check this out. Yeah. 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 Yeah.